Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another episode of Batman Arkham Knight. Now, in this video and other videos that, are, that will be uploaded in the future, they're just going to be um, little clips. Well, not little clips, but just mostly highlights of like the game. Because most of the time, I'm just exploring the areas, trying to figure things out, solve puzzles, and all that good stuff. Um, so I don't want to show you those boring moments. So I'm just going to be... Mo you're mostly going to be watching important parts to me and highlights. And... Um, probably some gameplays that might help some of you guys figure out some the Riddler uh, riddles where you could locate the trophies and how to get them. So let's go ahead and get started and I hope you guys enjoy the video. Progress with the fear toxin analysis. It's gonna take a little while longer. Drop by the clock to her when you're ready, and I'll show you what I've got so far. <laughs> I was like, you to drive. <laughs> it's like about time you brought me to the police station. Sorry, guys, I was out there fighting crime, leveling up. Found like three Riddler trophies. Scarecrow's gonna break you, Batman. Honestly, why do you even bother with these meat sacks? Civil unrest? There's a war on the streets. We don't have the manpower or the equipment. Well, look who it is. Ivy. Well, that's one less thing to worry about. Is the isolation chamber ready? Glad you're putting it to good use. Oh, good. Another cell. Hmm. Sorry, Ivy. Poor Ivy. You feel safer now that I'm all locked up. Child of Fear. We no longer have control of this city. Nobody's coming to help us. And the scum out there on the streets will do everything in their power to make sure it stays that way. Now you all had your chance to evacuate. You all made your choices. You have my word that each and every one of you will be commended when this is over. But the work starts now. That's Priority if they make it out of here alive. Lives, and it starts with the lives of your fellow officers right here at this precinct. I want a minimum of four guys on the roof at all times and a six-man element patrolling the perimeter. We keep this building locked down. The only people who get in or out are our guys and the Batman. Now, those punks out there think they own this city. And as things stand, they're right. We're outnumbered, outgunned, and understaffed. But if we work smart, we'll get through this and take back the city piece by piece. We have outlying patrols searching for Scarecrow in Bristol, Kingston, Drescher, Otisburg, and Port Adams. We got a half dozen choppers patrolling the skies, but make no mistake, we are not in control. Until we know what we're dealing with out there, so we have a solid lead on Scarecrow. Our priority is to dig in here and look out for our own. Any questions? Um. Okay, I'm gonna run through this. Oh, more never mind. So we're clear. <laughs> priority. Make <gasps> Ivy. No what are you doing? We're not in control. Until we know what we're dealing with out there. What the heck are you doing? Are you looking at your own hands? Like ooh. You know these walls won't hold me for long. Still, if it makes you feel safer, I'll indulge the fantasy. For now. Why do you waste your time helping these pathetic creatures? So primitive compared to plant consciousness. It was Harley who broke me out of that police cell in Bloodhaven. Why don't you try arresting her? <laughs> Locking me up is a sign of desperation, Batman. I can see it in your eyes. You're afraid. You can't lock me in here like some human. 
Alright, Abby. Alright guys, so yes, welcome to my new episode of Batman Arkham Knight. Like I said, you're probably gonna, not going to see me until after oh, yeah. I was done exploring Damn the map. Kratz. We're on our own. We can handle it, Jim. What's the latest? We've got incidents cropping up all over the city. Cash, give us a rundown. Alright, let's see. First up, we've lost contact with the fire crew from Station 17. We've got their last known coordinates, but they're not going to survive out there on their own for long. Then there's this. It's what? a strange one. Body turned up. We didn't have long to look before the evacuation, but the forensics boys seem freaked out. Real nasty. Also, we've had several sightings of the Riddler creeping around the train yard. Yeah. Knowing that guy, he's got to be up to no good. The train yard. Look, I know you're busy, but anything you can do to help is going to save lives. Don't worry, Jim. I have someone working a lead on Scarecrow. I'll see what I can do. Good to hear. I've got a skeleton crew searching Gotham South and West. I'm gonna join him when I'm done here. We're gonna find that son of a bitch. <gasps> Fernandez, it's Gordon. Give me an update. Okay. Mission Select. Use the Mission Select screen to select your next target in Gotham City. When locating a new supervillain or mission, they will be automatically added to the screen. Select the icon if you... Re you want to return to the hunting down scarecrow. Alright. Alright. How do you Oh. Alright, alright, alright. No, I don't care about the leaderboard. Can we Ah. I only got yeah, you see? I only got three trophies from Riddler sort of exploring the, the map. What's this? Oh my. I don't care about the leaderboard. We're gonna save our friends. I'll find that missing fire crew. Okay. Good luck out there, Batman. When you finish searching the docks, I want you to link up with Michaels and work your way back along the East River. Somebody was supposed to go in here too? Let's see what happens. Alright. <clears throat> we have enormous hostile tanks deployed across the city. Gotham is under attack. Well done, guys. I hear my cats making a lot of noise. Do you feel safer now that I'm all locked up? All right. We keep this building locked down. Ready to go. Never seen him up close before. We've got you back in here, Batman. All of us. Well, Owens from the diner probably wants you dead, but everyone else, Team Batman. Hmm. <laughs> Thank you. Yep, poor bastard. He ain't gonna be able to live with himself when he finds out what he did in that diner. He's gonna lose his badge for sure. Oh, Owens man. is a good cop. Lives for the job. He don't deserve this. <laughs> Paramedics say there's nothing we can do for him. Just pray. That would suck, yeah. I wouldn't be able to live with myself if... I did what he did at that diner. No, no, no. Hey, Batman! Guess Scarecrow gave you the slip. You broke my wrist for nothing. He's got plans for you, Batman. You and all your friends. Tonight's the night we finally break the bat. <laughs> but what's over here? Interview room. No records, nothing. The preacher? He won't stay hidden for long. 
What are you doing here, Ryder? Hey, how's my favorite masked vigilante? One of those nights, huh? You shouldn't be in the city. Bet you're wondering about the tape. I'll let you in on the action, if you promise to keep me in the loop. What do you say? It's not safe. You should have left with the evacuation. And missed the biggest story of the year? Hell, the century. This is it. My chance to get back on top. Quid pro quo, Batman. What's the latest on Scarecrow? Any leads? Stay out of trouble. Hey, I try. Trouble always finds me. Jack Ryder. Let's take a look at him. I'm not too familiar with this character. Jack Ryder is an investigation reporter turned controversial talk show host. Well known for his aggressive manner of his relentless determination to get the truth following his brush with the death of an <gasps> The death in Arkham City writer wrote a serious and by this own his testimony provided influential and state decisions to release a number of falsely imprisoned inmates, many whom received substantial packages. He sounds familiar, the name. With following through the her ooh with chlorophyll flow, flowing through her veins instead of blood. Imagine she developed a toxic touch and a pheromone fluid talent for seduction. Her unique brand of terrorism terrorism is often puts her into conflict with Batman, whose iron will usually protects him from her seductive powers. I kind of don't like how her clothes is just so tight on her. It's like, you know what? Um, I don't know. It just doesn't look good on her. Give her something else to wear or something. Everything else, look, everything else looks cool. Batman, we're not doing too good in here. It don't look it, but we're the lucky ones. That's it. My wife. Great help we all turned out to be. The low lives out there must be laughing at us. Just stay still. Hello, Carly Quinn. Two Face. Batman, just want to say it's good to have you on board. You're probably safer than all of us down here put together. But be careful, please. Upgrade. Air support saw it turn into some kind of. Mm, they're all checking it out. Nice. Don't get too close. He's here. Back up. Good evening, Mr. Wayne. I hope the car is performing to your high expectations. Actually, Lucius, she's a little sluggish. <laughs> I had a feeling you'd say something like that. Give me a few moments, and I'll bring the afterburner function online. Thanks, Lucius. It was good of you to stay behind. You want to thank me, Mr. Wayne? Just try not to hurtle off the road. I should have some more upgrades ready soon. Yeah, he's the one who develops weapons, gadgets, vehicles, and armor for Bruce Wayne. And Batman. Mm -hmm. Well, Batman, mostly. Alright, we still got other characters, too. Ah, sorry. I've been. I've been. I just want to take a look at this area. Hold on. Have your fun. You are under my protection. To the 
cowards quaking behind the police department's walls, you will not be spared. And to Batman, I have already won. Emptied your city with a vial of toxin and a few threatening words. That's how little the safety you provided was worth. And when the dawn comes, when Gotham lies in ruin and I turn my gaze to the world beyond, the legend of the Batman will be worth nothing at all. All right, what's the next mission? Meet Oracle at the clock tower to help locate Scarecrow. All right, so she's over here, right? Clock tower? Oh, no, 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 no. I was pressing the wrong button. clock tower what the heck so it's one person perspective oh I'm in here Activate a control switch, remote switch. Do I come in the back cave, start messing with all your stuff? You've managed to reduce the compound to its core elements. But there's nothing in there that we can trace. What if we'd been looking at this the wrong way? Instead of searching for the toxin, what if we focus on the manufacturing process? Why didn't I see this? The reaction emits a unique radiation spike. Run a scan of the city for this energy signature. It will show where Scarecrow is creating his fear toxin. It'll take a few hours to bring the satellites into position. We don't have enough time. I'll repurpose the antenna at the movie studios. Bruce, I spoke to Dad. Oh. I hate lying to him. He'd kill me if he knew I was still in the city. He still blamed himself for this. We'll stop, Scarecrow. Oh, look at that. Isn't that like an Easter egg right here? The ghost in gray. Let me know when you've reached the antenna, and I'll run a citywide scan for those radio waves. Did they get out through there? Jim, we've got a way to find out where Crane's working from. Thank God. What can I do? Get your men ready. As soon as we've got a location, I'll let you know. All right. Now what? 
Stop Scarecrow, uh, use the to location. You thought me gone, didn't you, Batman? Locked in the waters beneath Arkham. Unlike all submerged, forgotten fears, eventually I returned. There we go. It's uh, this site. The fire crew's in danger. I'm going to find them before it's too late. Yeah, let's go find them. Where do we have to go? What's this? No. I need to go find my friends. Wait a minute. Oh. <gasps> Okay, we're kind of we're close here, so that's. found the mutilated body Cash was talking about. I'm going to try and establish a cause of death. Blood tests reveal the cause of death was an overdose of painkillers leading to cardiac arrest. Also, the victim's fingerprints have been burned off with acid. A rather unsavory demise. That's not all. It's as though the subject's DNA has been corrupted somehow. There's insufficient information for me to cross-reference the database. I'll have to use the deep tissue scanner to analyze the body for distinguishing features and determine the victim's identity. Right you are, sir. All right, scan, hold. There's something here. No? All right, let's look at the face. Intestine. The inscription reads Ophelia. Hmm. This ear? Deformity on the left ear. Looks like a result of minor ear agenesis. A birth defect. I guess that's it. Yeah. 
something here. The victim had a hip replacement. Scar tissue hasn't fully healed, so it must have been recent. Alfred, the victim's name is Anthony Lund. Hospital records show he suffered with alcoholism, most probably brought on by the breakdown of his marriage. The name on the ring, Ophelia, his ex-wife. He was last seen in Albuquerque, New Mexico. What's unusual is that they didn't go missing in Gotham. They were brought here and killed. Why? We need to track down whoever did this. Might I suggest keeping an ear out for any more of that ghastly opera music? It sounds ominously like a calling card. All right, we got that. Alright, where is it? It's here. You got it. Bob! <gasps> right at the fucking. <laughs> that. Come on, there's a fight going Tell me what you know. All right, I'll talk. Just don't hurt me. Good. Thank you. It's underground. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, he looked all burned up. Ooh, look, that's a cool drawing. Hmm. Hello there, detective. Yes, it's me, your most feared nemesis, the Riddler. Congratulations are in order, for you have arrived early for this, the next generation of my riddles. I'm afraid the full particulars of my plan will have to remain unannounced for the time being. But I see no harm in rewarding the harmless little glimmer of initiative you have shown with a sneak peek, a preview, if you will, of the kind of conundrum I have in store. It begins. You are staring, <clears throat> with stupefied incomprehension, at a mechanism I have calibrated to respond to an extremely precise radar pulse. In a moment, I will give you the decrypted code, Dark Knight. Oh, but first, 
I think we should run through the ground rules for tonight's festivities. Rule the first. You will address me at all times as Riddler, the Riddler. Hmm. Otherwise, detective, I expect your patented brand of churlish silence. Rule the second. All gauntlets, cowl-integrated microphones, and other communications devices, bat-themed or otherwise, are to be switched off prior to the start of the test. Should you be caught using any of these, you will be expelled from the course. Spell. Rule the third. The use of purpose-built riddle-solving equipment is strictly prohibited. I am familiar with the contents of your utility belt, Detective, and I will be evaluating any sudden additions over the course of this evening most suspiciously. Rule the fourth. In the event of fire or flood, I will be on hand to guide you to the nearest emergency exit. Assuming, that is, you are not too proud to follow my advice. <laughs> In that eventuality, we will consider your stubbornly prideful suicide an admission of defeat. Rule the fifth. Do not ask for clues. Rule the sixth. Should I, in my exasperation, choose to provide you with a clue, hint, obliquely meaningful insult, or any other form of assistance, you will not ask for further elucidation, but instead thank me for my kind generosity whilst adhering to the forms of address outlined in the very first rule. Rule the seventh. Bathroom breaks will be administered on a discretionary basis. Oh my Should God. we find ourselves at a pivotal moment in your arduous journey to self-realization and defeat, I expect you to hold it in. Rule the eighth. Any accidents resulting from my strict enforcement of the seventh rule are to be considered your fault entirely. Oh. Rule the ninth. You are required to recite back to me this full list of rules at any moment I request. Again, keeping in mind the naming conventions I outlined in the very first rule. Rule the tenth. I, the Riddler slash Riddler slash Mr. Nigma Sir, reserve the right to add or announce further rules if and when they become necessary. Please. Yes, I know what you're thinking, Detective. Mr. Nigma Sir knows how to meticulously structure a good time. In any case, Detective, I'm getting rather tired of the way your stupidity forces me to outline the basics like this. So here's that code you've been waiting for. Let's see how long it takes for you to figure out how to use it. Oh boy, I know I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna do it good. Well done, Dark Knight. Isn't life more satisfying when you do as you're told? Welcome to my racetrack, Detective. You must complete three circuits of this gauntlet, finishing each before the time limit expires. Come now, Detective. Let's put that grotesque ego-mobile to the test. Be ready, Dark Knight. There's more to this test than just going rum, rum, really fast. I don't get it. Oh. I'm such an idiot. <gasps> oh! I didn't make it. Fuck. Alright, how am I gonna do this? Yo! Cool. Can that ram shackle motor handle this? Dark Knight, don't waste my time. It's several times more precious than yours. You fail! Your idiocy never ceases to... Well, actually, no. I have come to expect it. Well, actually, no. I just finished it. Faster, Dark Knight. You must heed along like the electrical signals in my 
Failsafe. I need the extra speed. I'm shocked. Uh. Is that really as fast as it goes? Damn. Interesting. <laughs> Did you really believe that a challenge designed by me, the Riddler, would be quite so easy? You sweet, naive sentinel. Of course it wouldn't. Still, thanks to your unrelenting desire to showboat, I now have several hundred terabytes worth of performance data relating to that latest model of rocket-powered hearse you're driving. Naturally, I shall be using this data to calibrate further challenges and trials. I'll see you soon, Detective. There's a lot more to come. Alright guys, thank you all so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this episode of Batman Arkham Knight. We will continue with this in the next episode, and we hope to see you all there. And for now, everybody take care of yourselves, and have fun out there. Bye-bye. <laughs>